Good morning everyone. Hope everyone's having a marvelous day. It's around 8 and I'm just trying to get to the day. My boyfriend is so funny. He put this in here. <clears throat> when you're the one that puts everything away. Yeah. Alright, we're going to have some sushi this morning for breakfast because we got to eat it before it goes to bed. We're trying to get productive-y, but we're getting distracted by YouTube instead of making YouTube videos. So, we got our cute chopsticks. We got them from the box set. So, we got our candles lit, our positive mindset, and we're going to eat some good sushi. So, I'm excited. And I've lit my candle. It did get a little melty, but it's okay. Well, it is a candle. So we're just gonna eat it. All right, come on. Mm. Okay. Catch you in later. Good morning, everyone. I'm starting to revive after all the caffeine. Just taking it as a slow day. I took off all the stuff off my fingernails so that's great also uh i'm thinking about doing a declutter of the little things that are in here the grit things just because i don't think that's actually going to help my stuff like i don't know if it's gonna work long term so i do have these really nice expensive ones that took it off even better and less issues so got a little bit of candy hmm. it's finally warmed up in here either that or it's warmer outside i can't tell but <coughs> came over here for a reason all right here we go oh, i've got to unpack some stuff so let's see what we got I'm looking for my deodorant somewhere over here. Ah. I took these things. And we're gonna take this. Come on. Perfect. Don't think there's anything else except for Judy to charge those headphones, but I only have one hand. Decided to be doing my Amazon haul today and my necklace that my brother-in-law gave me. He gives me the really really good stuff i appreciate him he's the absolute best my sister could have not married a better person and this stuff leave this out i don't know what we're gonna do with her hair so let's put that in there i'm also unpacking from things that i did not use so including this stuff um today i'm gonna dress up after the gym if i can get to the gym i'm just all over the place today and I'm trying not to film me doing all over the place things. So, yeah. Also, uh, I am hoarding single-use stuff. I know it's a stupid thing, but it's like when I travel, I bring a couple of these and I throw them away. So, the gym we have is nice and stuff. So, I also take it if you've already paid for it. Also, I need to use the rest of this up. Okay. Okay. Well. This is not empty. I can put it in here. One of these days I haven't done it yet. I'm gonna have to go through all my travel stuff. Yeah. Also, um, really help. I'm thinking about replacing this fur with a pullover that's velvet because that shed's really, really bad. And it's just because no one took care of it. <laughs> and rabbit is really um the shed really fast, so. Alright, let's clean our face. Before I do that, <clears throat> I need to keep all these. I'm going to open a new set. These need to go out of this. I actually need to bring this. I cannot wait for my Halloween scrubs to come. Fortuna, chilling with me. What else do I need to do? Oh, I actually need to buy a second one of these. So, Amazon again. It's been an amazon -y week. One of these cords, I think the other one's already in there. Put that in there. Okay, is there anything else to do that does not need to be? Oh, oh, I can't tell you guys that yet. So, dang it. I'm wondering if I'm allergic to this because, let's see here. Put this bunch on and we're going to test if we are. 
If it starts turning red and acting up when it dries, I'll know I'm allergic to this and then I'll toss it. Because the only thing I can think also is right here, besides the toothpaste thing, I'm allergic to something. Am I breaking out? Smells really good. And we'll put it in another spot too. Put it on our arm. Stranger things have been known to happen. Oh, and I was looking for this earlier today. All right, here we go. All right, got that out of the way. Got my bag packed, my outfit packed. Now we just gotta do our skincare. These are slowly getting better. I think I also need to wash my pillowcase. That might help a little bit. I also need to wash some pillows that I found downstairs. I have no idea what this thing is going on. And I can't tell if I'm breaking out. I think I am. I think just for safe safety, I'm just gonna toss that thing. Just because I don't want any issues. So anywho. So we an adventure. Don't want that much. Yeah, so just trying to get ready for the day. It's my day off from work. Hope everything's going well at work. Uh, I'm also going to be using my sample moisturizer. We're going to see how it does with my skin because my skin is so dry. Like, colossal dry. It's getting a little bit irritating because of how bad it's been breaking out. So. <sighs> Also noticed that my hair is kind of not looking great because I haven't used um, the hair stuff. Um, my hair oil that I made for the rice water, just looking kind of blah. I'm also thinking when I finally project pan everything, I'm just gonna go back to basics. I guess I like trying new skincare, but I think I think I'll just uh, change it up, maybe simplify it a little bit. Just cause there's always a lot going on. Yes, twelve step, probably still do that, but I don't need to have a ton of it because I kind of know what works with my skin. So just trying to keep it all together. And I do think there's some of my products that I put on my face that aren't as effective than some other ones. Yes, my skin is changing and the light therapy is helping. But yeah, I don't... We'll see. Okay, I've done that, that. Also, I don't know if this one is super effective compared to this one. I think maybe because I just wanted to try the other brand. Yeah. So I'm probably not going to repurchase this one. Just, but I will repurchase probably in a couple months that vitamins. I'm not super impressed with this one. So but this one I really like. It is a little bit more expensive. And I'm trying, oh, it's the face shop. The face shop I think I actually like better than the, um, that other brand. This one is a collagen booster. That's very heavy, which I like. Hmm. Yeah. So I probably will not repurchase this one again, which is fine, uh, but I will get that vitamin C serum because that one was fabulous. All right, speaking of serum, serum time. I'm hoping that Sephora or Ulta will start selling this brand. I'll have to research it. Huh. 
also have got some new pooftas. I call them pooftas. The main makeup smudges. And I finally just said, screw it, and I got a case for all of them. Well, not all of them. I did get a pack of like 10 or something, just because they do wear out. I like to keep them clean, all that stuff, so. Mm -hmm. grateful it is Saturday. I am grateful that I was able to get my nails done. And I mean done, I mean taking off all the glue. They actually look a lot better. My sister is the nail person. So uh, she had said, hey, why don't you buy this? I'm like, okay. So I did and I love it. And yeah, my um, she told me to get the cuticle remover. And honestly, if you're going to do your own nails, recommend it like it took all that off it didn't hurt my nails like I've just bad bad shenanigans on my nails so all right we are going to be putting on the super goop triple prep basically it's got sunscreen in it and I actually like this product I didn't think I was going to the other one is a little bit light casting which is kind of annoying. This one isn't as much. Also, I was telling my sister, I was nerding out about something and I was like, oh my gosh, did you know they make UV patches? So like for you to reapply your sunscreen, I'm like, oh, in summer, we've got to buy them. Probably should buy them in the winter. Maybe they're on sale. All right, I'm gonna add a little bit more of this stuff to kind of calm those spots down. This is very calming. Got this in Cabo. I have original prescription. I paid, my boyfriend paid for the appointment here. And then they're like, here is this, is prescription. And I just bought it over there. Okay, we're gonna let our face set. And we're gonna put on our lip oil though. I don't wanna wear lipstick today. And I do want a project pan this one. Okay, this Geisen, I'm not impressed at all. It's not hydrating. It gives you a shine for like five minutes and then it's shitty. Why this is viral, I have no idea. All right. That's it. It is pretty, but I plan on using up the rest of it and then just never repurchasing it. I did have a moment with Shine, and honestly, I like this one a lot better, and it's cheaper. This one is the Costas Wet and Wild, Wet uh, Lip Oil, and this one is in the shade Unhooked. Weird name, but okay. Yeah, so I'm just gonna be taking this today. Um, <clears throat> I also need to wash these baby brushes because they are disgusting. That is the one thing. Plan on doing on camera, so I know I've done it. If not, I'm just going to forget. I mean, look at that. That's gross. So I'm just going to set those palettes aside because it's got to be done anyways. So, might as well do it all once. And I am not organized because I have all these towels that are right here. And I desperately, I need to research um, how to make them soft again. Because these ones are, well they're, but these are not. So I'm gonna do some research today, figure that out. Awesome. I'm also having a love-hate relationship with my tripod. I'm thinking maybe if I try, I might try the mini for a day, just to see how it looks. Okay. See? It's going a little less red. Okay. Boyfriend is busy um, with a class, which is kind of cool. This one is a brand new one. That one's new. I bought them all together at the same time. Yeah, this one is built high. Look at that. Ooh. Okay. We gotta do it. We 
gotta do it. Yes, you do. You gotta do it. Thank you, Sissy, for this. I would repurchase them again. All right. Now, well, one of the things that I did buy is this pouch for a specific reason, because inside you can put all your brushes in the washer, which is what I'm gonna do today. pumps in there, some more water, fill her up, and then just gently brush the corners. Oh, look at that. That was really bad. Another thing too is sometimes the colors, you don't want all the colors to blend, sometimes you do. I'm just doing circle motions with it. Okay, that's clean. No more color transfer. Here we go. I'm gonna do all the brushes, these brushes first, just cause they're so bad. Just trying to be gentle with these because they don't make them so you can buy them. Cause if they did, I would buy a lot of them. Okay, I think this one goes good. Yep, now it's all good now. I'm gonna do one more rinse though. I don't need to sink for that one. I get it all. This one's super pigmented. Okay, now it's clean. I just want everything clean and happy. And everything is going to be fine. Like I tell my boyfriend, everything's gonna be fine. Got nowhere to go but up. Boyfriend is getting a little concerned about my shopping, but it's like, you know what? Got a job now. Things change. Spit was my spin. I used to be a super saver, and now I'm like, you know what? If I want to buy it, I think I'm just going to buy it. So I do. Because here's the thing is it's stuff that I've wanted for years. Sure, there's a few things that if they don't work, return them, which is fine, but. This is long-term shopping. This isn't like, oh, I'm just gonna buy it because it's cool. No, this is, I'm gonna buy this because I'm gonna use it for X, Y, Z. All my travel stuff I buy and have purchased recently, I've been having those things on my bucket list for like for two years. So it's like, you know what? Screw it, I'm gonna buy it. I'm traveling a lot. I plan on traveling more in future. I just want nice things, want good high quality things, and sometimes they're spendy. It's just like, but once you have it, you don't need it. It's just the quality. I hate when things are really, really bad quality. It just irritates me because they fall apart and it looks like crap. Then I have to buy something else. So that's why I hate, I don't like Temu. There's only one thing I will buy from Temu and that is uh, labels. See, this is so gross. I'm gonna turn this on a little higher. Yeah, labels. That's the one thing that I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna get. Gonna get labels from Temu because they're shitty off market brand ones and it just makes sense. It's like, why spend a lot of money for a label and just stick it on there? It's all the same shit. And I cannot get this stuff out. Dang it. I might actually have to wipe it out. Come on. What an issue. Wow, that stuff's pretty saturated. All right. Get it out. Wiping it out with tissue. So the whole point is to keep it all clean. Now it seems to have stained it. Weird. Eh. I'm pretty sure if I use Dawn, this stuff will come right out. I'm not gonna worry about that now. All right, I am gonna quickly get these little squeeze and then set them aside. 
only thing I'm gonna put on today is gonna be foundation just because of all the breakouts on my face that are not pleasant. Awesome sauce. I'm gonna just close these um, over here so nothing happens to them. Okay. All right. Off the rabbit hole of. Oh, that's empty. Okay. I'm trying to figure out how to make those soft again. So I used that bit and it took care of all my very painful, horrible, horrible hangnails, including this one that's been giving me grief for months and tears and pain and now that's all gone, including that boo-boo. It was so easy and thank you for being life-changing. All right, so now this is gonna be my full gym outfit. I am procrastinating, but I did find that a cup of white vinegar um, should make them uh, make them not have any more issues. Um, all I did was put in white vinegar, put it on hot, and then I sprayed a bunch of it on there, and then I put a cup of it in here. So basically I put in two, just because I'm sure this towel has been super, super washed. And now we're gonna see if it works. Also, if you over dry your towels, like on super, super high, you're just baking them and you're just ruining them. So, kind of low key excited for this. I've got 50 minutes to see how this works. Then I'll put them on low in there so I don't overdo it. Coming up with a new system so my boyfriend doesn't touch my stuff. Basically, I'm just bagging it and putting it in the bag and be like, don't touch it because I got so upset last time. Right now, I'm trying to find my shoes. Everything is a big mess, and I'm making peace with that. Okay, first off, first, I need to put on some makeup. We're gonna be using this. This filter is pretty good. I'm gonna put this one on, and we've been using the tart. Now, I'm gonna tell you right now, this tart is super, super orange. It is the wrong shade for me, so I have to always put more light stuff on it, but it is a really good product, so I wouldn't repurchase it in this color, but it does help with the redness, so yeah. And I bought more of these just because these are superior to even Tartars, because Tartars started literally crumbling, and I'm still mad about it. Okay, and don't want to pack this with me, so this is what we'll bring. I actually need to reapply this. It doesn't really last. It's like five minutes and you're reapplying again. So my boyfriend just let me know that he is gonna be done with that class and he's headed home. I need to go to um, the Apple store and I'm driving it. I've been procrastinating it and it's really shitty. And I, <laughs> because the area is not very good where it's at, I gotta take everything out of my car. Yeah. Oh, so cold in the garage. Yeah, so I can't remember what stuff I've got in my car. Let's see, how bad is it? Ritz crackers, a few things. All right, did I leave my fridge in there? So I'm gonna have to take out the battery pack and the fridge because I'm not having shenanigans. Heck to the no. All right, we're gonna do an Amazon haul. So first things first, yeah, the box is kind of shitty, um, but I did get, Oh, what's it called? Um, I got a capsule set from Candice. They're the electronic, they're the magnetic ones. Because I travel and I don't want to bring, um, I don't want to bring the big air pumps, I can bring these and that'll work. The only thing that's kind of disappointing is they don't sell the tiles separately. So if you wanted to, you could, have another one for like cleanser, 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 toner, that whole thing. That's a little irritating because then these small ones are great. 
but then of course the blank one. So yeah, I'm gonna probably have to, if I'm gonna travel with my shampoo and conditioner, it's gonna be already travel size, like one of my samples I bought online. And that's what, what I'll carry with. <coughs> I don't know, we'll see. So this is the whole thing together. Only thing is these do not attach to these. Other than that, pretty cool. Been on my list forever. I got this cleaning tool. I've seen one of my favorite um, Instagram -y people use it. And so, yeah. This is RC. And it basically comes with a bunch of attachments. These ones. These ones. And I assume this grippy thing right here so that these attach. Yeah, that's what I was right thinking. And then this one too. So it's just gonna help me with cleaning around when my boyfriend cooks and spills all over. So this is, comes with its own instructions. Two little niches. I have no idea what those are actually for. Oh, it's for the bottom, for the charging. That one. It's like, okay, cool. Anyways, it's waterproof and I can't wait to use it because I am tired of doing all the scrubbing in the kitchen sink. So, this is why I bought it. All right. Put that product to the side. All right. I bought a toothpick holder thing that I've been seeing everywhere. So, it holds 10 of them. Just push it up and then um, it dispenses it. You can open it and refill it, which is one of the reasons why I bought it, because I can refill it with the other ones that I have. So that's gonna be nice. My sister's been super impressed by uh, this guy here. So yeah, he got cleaning stuff because it bothers me greatly when I can't get certain things clean in the kitchen. I don't know where that cord is though. It's supposed to come with a cord. Hmm, weird. Or the battery press. Oh, batteries. Nice. <coughs> All right. Hmm. Got the Roomba parts. We'll see how it works. Got a scrubbing set. <laughs> All right, we're back. Oh, and this came with set of two. All right, <clears throat> so I've got this brush. I just hate not being able to reach certain areas. This has a little sharp side, kind of like to dig things out. And this has a little scrapey. Interesting. And then these our um, kitchen cleaning brush set. Clean up in this one. And they have cute little paws. It's gonna help immensely get in those hard to reach places. Don't think I'd be using this one a lot just because I don't know what I'd be using it for. Right here. So basically, a lot of cleaning supplies. <clears throat> and I've always wanted to try this. I said, screw it, gonna get it. <clears throat> so this is Tearaway Microfiber Cloths. The brand is fantastic -y. Fantastic, fantastic I don't know, fantastic -y. Clean. <clears throat> Tell my boyfriend we're gonna try these instead of paper towel just because it gets, it's getting too expensive. So <clears throat> we'll see how that goes. Yeah, and that is the entire Amazon haul for this one. I've got a few things coming in the next two weeks and yeah, that's about it. Have a great day, guys. Oh, so we've put them in here. We'll see how they do. Some of them just don't feel super soft. I might try it again, but I'm not sure if I want to. So I put on low setting and 
Some of them softened it, but some of them may just may not come back. But I'll try it again. We'll see how they turn out in 26 minutes. Also, the candy I just ate, I'm not feeling the greatest. So I don't think I probably should be eating that much candy. So yeah, that's not making me feel awesome. Need to turn off some lights though. Got everything out of the car. Yeah, no, oof, I am not feeling great at all. Oh, I need to put this in the car. Well, the bag to take to the car. Okay, it's all gonna be great. Look at him. He is right in my backyard. He's fucking huge. Peter, she come hunting. Believe that is a good sign considering he was right there. <laughs> There's also something wrong with him. Going on a nature hike, going on a nature hike, going on a nature hike with Auntie. Huzzah! Going on a nature hike, going on a nature hike. Going on a nature hike, yeah! Hey ma'am, I'm having fun. Alright guys, I'm pretty much gonna end the vlog here. Uh, I did make the bed to do all that laundry for the bed. I do need to wash a couple of the blankets, like really, really wash them, but I need to take them downstairs so they can be better agitated. Closet is still a hot mess, but I've kind of made peace with that. Um, I went and got two things at Aldo, and, well, I'll show you the first one. Let's see if it'll pick it up in the mirror. Ooh. Got a cute little red bow. Just matching my current outfit. Wearing little red dress. Anyways, I thought this would be perfect for all the cleaning things, and I might be able to actually fit my little vacuum thing, so everything's in one place. Thanks. Okay, um... So, uh, one of the things I'm going to be grabbing, hold on, let me set you guys down, maybe, maybe, okay, so I'm cleaning the dreaded cabinet thingy, not cabinet thingy, um, gas stove, I'm going to be using this new thing to clean it, because I don't think anything else will help, also, when the dishwasher is all clean, I'll be able to, um, but in the remaining dishes, I've been having massive issues with all this weird food splatted, splattage, splooge. Anyways, I've already washed the filter twice, so I don't know what's going on. It is getting aggravating, um, cause it keeps creating a mess and it's really starting to bother me. So I'm starting to get irritated cause I just scrubbed like nine glasses and like three bowls on the outside. Inside's clean, outside's not, so. And then this bad boy is all 100% charged. So I will be putting, let's see which one we want. Uh, let's do this one. We're going to be using this. We're going to scrub um, our copper sink. Yes, unfortunately it is real copper. It's so pain to clean. All right, branch over. I finally have something I can use for all this new stuff. Keep it in one place so I don't lose my mind. Still proud I made the bed. Yes, it's not perfect. It is got a little bit warmer, which is nice. I need to put my iPad away. I did order a second tray of that. My boyfriend's watching the game downstairs. Got a few fun things. All this stuff. And my kitchen is clean, except for these dishes because I keep having the same issue over and over and it's bothering me. Where is it? Where's that stupid spot? So this came out of the dishwasher. Supposedly clean. I lost my proverbial shit.
this is currently being running right now. So that's great. I'm hoping it works. So next thing on my agenda is to scrub that, all that black with my new thing. So we're gonna see how well this works in between the corners and I'm just done with it being a hot mess. So everything else has been cleaned. Yep, all clean. This stuff's all over here. I've not used this yet. I'm more worried that my boyfriend's gonna accidentally throw it away. But I really think maybe I need to like put it little put it in a little picture frame or something. The instructions. I don't know. I just the expense of the towels is just making me so up irritated and everything going up. I'm just one less thing to deal with. I realized today that there's some shitty things that I desperately needed, so I bought it from Amazon. We're gonna have Amazon haul. I am very well acknowledged that I have to do a no spend year tomorrow. I mean, not tomorrow, uh, next year. Completely like don't spend on anything, which is gonna be really, really hard. So I've been, I did have one really good no spend month, but it's because I was traveling. If you're not stationary, you can't buy stuff because it's not shipped to your house. Also, when I do travel to Arizona again in a couple weeks, I'm not buying any clothes. I'm not buying anything. I may want stuff, but I'm not going to buy anything at all. All right. We're hanging in there. I've got a lot of stuff. Also, um, update on the towels. And I need to wash this one. Oh, well, perfect. So these ones are so threadbare. I don't think it's going to revive them. They're going to be stiff as a board. Unless I literally take an entire gallon of vinegar and soak them for like days. This one, same deal. This one kind of perked up a little bit. But it's probably because it wasn't on high heat beforehand. This one did a lot better, which is great. So these ones, I'm gonna have to do the whole thing again, but I'm trying to get a bunch more towels before I do that. Anyways, back to the world of awesome. I am trying to plan strategically within my brain what I am bringing because I'm invited to my boyfriend's work party and I need an outfit for that. The temperature's going to be interesting because I had no idea what it is. It's irritating and aggravating and I'm hanging in there. So the one thing that I really, really, really uh, want is a smooth transition for us getting to the airport, all that good vibe. We've got to, oh shoot, got to tell my boyfriend, where are we parking my car? My sister is awesome, but it's, it's just, they're, they've got so many construction workers coming and stuff like that, that it just, it's not kind to be like, hey, can we borrow park our cars there? It just doesn't make sense. So even if we were to be like, hey, borrow our cars, we'll gas them up, you know, that whole thing is still not going to work. Okay. Now it's covered in oil. Now my hand's covered in oil. Ugh. All right, we're going to clean. I'm just glad I can see counters that are clean. Yay me. All right, we're gonna chat about our day. First of all, um, Apple Store was not successful at all. I'm still irritated, irritated about that whole situation. Not happy. Mm -mm. No, no, just no. It was not a good experience. And they're like, do you wanna leave a review? I'm like, I'm not paying thousands and thousands of dollars for a screen when all I need is an outdated one. Makes sense. But not to them. Looked on eBay, can't find it. I don't even know what year they started making the display screens over the computers. I don't know. So yeah, it's gonna be Hail Mary. 
and I'm not sure what how I'm going to manage. Laundry, we're back at it again. Oh. I added even more stuff in it, more vinegar, I just dumped the whole thing in it because I want it to be softer. Giving it one more go and if not, I make, make my piece and I try everything to re-soften how scratchy they are. Skin's looking better. This is kind of gone a little out of control, but I keep touching it. I gotta walk my sister's gorgeous dog. I had anxiety all day about cleaning the house. Then all I did was when I got home after I ate, my boyfriend made a beautiful meal. Literally. After all of that trepidation, all that shit, he's like, hey, um, I cooked. Do you mind cleaning? I'm like, nope. By the way, he's very shitty at cleaning. I usually end up doing half of it, but here's the thing is he does do the dishwasher like a boss. He's just not allowed to do laundry anymore. And I mean that cutely. I, I, I've got all my feelings out. Yes, today I was influenced by multiple influencers. I did you do the scrubby thing <coughs> that I showed you guys on that, oh, what's it called? <clears throat> on the gas stove, yeah, it didn't come off. I don't know if I needed a product that's more abrasive to get it off, because how it's been so bad. Oh no. Might be going to the dollar store. I have an idea, tentatively. All right. I'm gonna show you about a Sephora. So this, yeah, me, I'm not gonna buy anything. Yeah, that went out the window after, <coughs> after I couldn't get what I wanted. I'm like, screw it. I'm going to my happy place, Sephora. And I got Tatcha. I got the set. So this one is, um, oh, it's made in Japan. I've, I've had some of these. I had a sample and really, really enjoyed it. So I bought that, the Silk Serum, the Dewy Skin Cream Refillable Pod. I bought the refillable one because it was cheaper than buying the whole thing. All right, we're gonna open this carefully. See what it looks like. Is there even the lid on that? Nope, there's no lid, just this, but that'll be fine because what I'm going to do is I'm gonna put it in one of my other little things. Dang, this thing's tiny. Anywho, my skin, I honestly think because of how dry everything is or all the stuff I've been using is so drying, it's freaking out. Got that one, okay. I got the Dewy Serum. And the Violet C Brightening Serum. You can tell I really like skincare when you buy a lot of it. All right, and I did use um, some of that. Ouch. So I used the, what is it called? Oh, that SPF stuff was really nice. So use that. It was. Good experience. Wondering if my other toners can be better than this one. This one's supposedly a race one, supposed to be a little brightening and all that shit. I have no idea if it actually works. Hmm. <sighs> if 
I wasn't touching it, it would heal. But I can't stop touching it. I'm a skin picker. There's something on my face, I have to touch it, I have to remove it, I have to scratch it, I have to dig at it. Until it pretty much is an issue. Which is what's been going on with my face. It's not stress, it's just a nervous tick. That I can't control. It's also why I'm a nail biter. Why I bought a ton of press on nails. Cause I'm like, okay, if I can keep it glued on, I can grow out my nails. And at least I'll have something on my nails. My brushes are clean. They look fabulous. Don't forget those eyebrows. They get dry too. Clean pillow, clean sheets, everything's clean. Trying to hydrate my boo boos because of how bad they are. Kind of be glad to be done with this one. This one was okay. sister got some horrible results today that are not good for her. She's got some issues with her back and basically on bed rest for six weeks. No, she's not pregnant. She's been told by a doctor she's not allowed to lift anything, do anything, bend anything over for six weeks. She's going to be living in a back brace. I just so bad for her. She's been so much pain. No one should live their life in pain, especially if you don't know why was wrong. So she will get better. She just has to be patient with herself and not do anything. I told her, I'm like, hubby better have a housekeeper or he better keep up on everything. She literally can't do anything, like nothing. The remodel is looking fabulous, except for there's some issues with their flooring because someone was not careful and damaged it. And it's brand new flooring, so they might have to redo it at the cost of the person that installed it. Yes. Alright, 
where all my lotions and potions are put on. I'm gonna rub it in really, really well. Look at that, that's starting to look even better. All right, <sighs> we're going to bed. Night guys, sleep well. After all this soaks in, my skin is super dry, so moisture for the win. Night.